Hi, I am Ioana Avram and I'm a fashion designer and a fashion illustration teacher from Romania, Europe. How to design a clothing line in 2.5 minutes? The steps to create a fashion collection are the followings. First, the research, and for this, I choose the image in the left side of the screen. Then, the documentation sketches, this means I draw the image with as many details as possible. Only drawing a thing, you will get to understand it and understand how it was made. When doing this, I feel like capturing its essence. When drawing anything, I try to underline the elements that compose the image. In this case, the three elements are the followings. The wire cage, the renaissance color and the small ribbons. Once I have these elements, I know how to draw the source of inspiration. And then the next step, while underlining them again, I think of how to combine them in different outfits. For A figure, I use the cage wire to sketch these huge sleeves. Then the pattern used in the collar was placed on the blouse and the rest I left simple. Because as I said in other videos too, it is always nice to have an equilibrium and not to overcrowd the costume. For the B figure, the cage was put upside down so that it created a volumetric blouse. The color pattern I use it for the lower part of the sleeves. For C figure I played with the color and I made it double in size. As about the ribbons that I did not use until now, now is the moment to exaggerate the volume, so here it is, a huge ribbon as a short skirt. So the three elements you can compose and combine as you want and as you saw in this video. And now, if you rotate the image, new ideas will come. You can use each element, resize it, make it as a module, big or small, use parts or the whole element. The collar and also the sleeves are made from the renaissance pattern and the skirt was made from wires. This time the ribbons are smaller disposed in the middle. As for the fourth element, if you want to consider these two as an accessory, you can use it in super size for the head. Thank you for watching and as always, please do not forget to leave me a thumbs up if you like it. Also, if you want to be the first one to know about my videos, please subscribe. Thank you and see you next week, same time, same place, here on Fashion Teaching Channel.